Yes, boys. Welcome back to Magic Magic. Today we have uh, the one win, the one rivals game that I promised yesterday. For of course our seven wins, we have the rivals rewards mixed up in there with a load of packs. So yeah, hope you enjoy all of that. And if I quickly go over to SBCs, you can see that in tomorrow's episode, hopefully. We will have completed Zidane. I know I'm far behind and everyone's completed Zidane for probably like two, three months now. Yeah, I know, I know. I'm working on other stuff as well, you know, Morgan, Sauer, just Pulisic for the low rated fodder. I'm thinking of doing, I'm thinking of doing Modric because I don't want to buy his other cards. I might maybe do Saliba, but I'm definitely going to do Bruno and Alex Morgan. Sauer is a maybe. And I'm definitely doing Kante, and I'll complete these over time. These guys have over a month. But yeah, just a load of ri uh, a Rivals game and a load of packs, because they bring out a load of packs for us to complete. So I hope you enjoy that. Uh, please leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe as well. I post daily. And I'm also on TikTok. Kai1057 on TikTok. Come check that out as well. And that's it from me. Enjoy the video, and I'll see you in a bit. Right, we're into the Rivals game for the video, and it was a terrible squad, I'll be honest. And this guy got battered, and he wouldn't quit. But it hopefully shows you guys how I play, in a sense. This was probably some of the best FIFA I've played. It was very good in the build-up. I was very patient on the ball. At the end, I had, like, 80 to 20 possession and yeah he was terrible but it's just the way I worked it round him like there was he literally couldn't get close to me like everything I did he just couldn't stop couldn't block couldn't read it couldn't literally could not do anything I just did everything perfectly this game and as you see we're already heading just about to score the fourth we do score the fourth in only 34 minutes. This guy got absolutely battered. He pauses it here. I was like, okay, good. He's going to quit. He doesn't. So we're just going to go lever him a bit more then. So Dina Tale just gets past her here. She catches up a bit. But Mudrick's there for the sweat. Van Dyke nowhere to be seen. Good. Van Dyke not being OP. Four once. He had the Socrates here. Obviously, I didn't see his team, so maybe it's Evo Socrates, but I don't think he should be either spending 200k on an Evo if his team's this terrible. As Mudrick makes it six in, f well, what, what, call it 50 minutes. And now 10 minutes later, got the ball of Mudrick, twist and turn, and this bit of dribbling there, bang, sent him shops with that little left right. Oh, and dribbling is insane. And then another cut back. Di Natale, look, he's just lunging everywhere. Just take the time till he lunges out of position like he did there. And simple goal, 8-0. And that was literally it. That is all that guy offered. He was dreadful. Absolutely dreadful. But it said, like, established 2023 October. So he might have got the game for his birthday or something. And this is the first FIFA he's ever played. But as you can see, there's seven wins. And now we're just going to scroll for objectives. We are level 10 for Julian Brandt, I believe. And to be honest, this card is terrible. At this point in the year, it's terrible. Like, we got better cards in, like, September and October. And they decided to bring it out now. Not a double play style plus. You can tell why it's free. We head over to the, the store. We've got a couple packs in stock at the minute. But don't worry, there's, we open about 50 packs in this episode. I'm not even lying to you. We get a Danish centre mid. Yeah, horror. When it's Ericsson, it's a horror show. You don't want to see that. You absolutely do not want to see that. And an 84 triple. This one was... Terrible. Kieran Trippier. From a guaranteed 84 plus pack. That is not what you want at all. You expect at least a walkout from that. But pack weight has been horrible. So you can't really say much about that. But we got a couple packs here. German centre mids. We got Gundogan. That's good. I don't mind that. Gundogan is good. 
very, very good for fodder wise anyway. Step closer to doing Zidane. We do go and sort out that Adams because we don't want to waste him. This is our rivals rewards, by the way, everybody. This is rivals rewards. I put this in first because it made more sense, and then the packs after it are for six o'clock packs that we opened. And we get Pereira out of this one. And should get another W. And um, we just get rid of Kovacic there. The club is dead. For lower rated cards. We've got a Jumbo Premium Pack. Rivals rewards are so bad. Like, they're so, so bad. Like, you get Champs rewards every week. And they're decent. I don't... Like, decent pack-wise, anyway. Not that you ever get anything from it. But I do wish you'd actually pack... Or get better rewards for Rivals. Because it's literally the same as Champs. Not in terms of difficulty, yeah, I know, but, like, the packs you get for Rivals, you get it once a week, like Champs, and Rivals rewards are just horrible. It's not even worth playing for, but have got to get the content out. Then we just have some random player picks scattered around from daily play. Just, daily play in general just is a waste of time, isn't it? And then, fantastic, my... Game decided to crash, so the store froze, the game crashed, so we had to reload and go again. So this is the other thing that I wanted to show you. We get an 85, the Catalair in the pack. It's not bad, it's going into SBC. Don't mind if I do. And then there's us checking our week theme pursuit. We got two left. Yes, I know, I've pretty much done it all in one day, but I just built like a squad of full of like 11 of them. And just basically got it all done in like three or four games. Maybe five games, I think it was. Of squad battles while doing Evos. As I'm thinking of doing the double playstyle plus Evo. But I don't know who to do it on yet. So I am waiting. I'm waiting patiently. Because we got the new Road to the Knockout promo. Or Road to the Final promo coming this Friday. So I want to see what's up with that. Before I decide to spend pretty much all my coins on a new Evo. Because I'm not doing that just to waste my time. Uh, we get double 83 there. The 83s I don't have. I pretty much have all of them in the game. And they actually managed to find some I don't have. So I appreciate that. As we get a Dutch centre mid from Al Etifak. Genie what? I don't even know who's on the game if I'm being honest with you. I can't even remember the last time Genie won Alden was ever in my mind, if I'm being honest. Maybe when you play for Liverpool, that's about it. And we get literally nothing from this pack. All non-rares, like, because I want rare contracts. thought this Liverpool kit would sell for something, but it didn't. That shows how big of a club Liverpool are. But we move on. We got some player picks here from claiming loads of the theme pursuit. This is like... Mm, pretty sure I've finished Theme Pursuit at this point. And I'm just saving all the player picks and packs for the end. Like I said, I did literally like a bunch all in one game. So this is mostly that lot. <laughs> so, you know, we check our Theme Pursuit. Still got a load left, but we have eight packs in the store. Let's crack them open. A premium gold pack. And yeah, horror show. Let's set about our one. An 84. I mean, it's not terrible, but realistically, you expect something better. The pack weight's been so horrible, you just you just want something better from that. But we move on, we move on. Small mixed players pack. And the rare we get is a bronze. Romania as well. Probably an Andrew Tate fan or something. It's another small mix. We've got quite a lot of these because the packs you get from Theme Pursuit is terrible. But at least we get a rare gold from this one. And it's silver. Andre Silver. I don't mind the bronzes and silver though. I do like doing the daily gold upgrades to get some packs. You get 11 players. One's rare. 10 non-rares. That's literally a crafting upgrade. Guaranteed. So I get four guaranteed crafting upgrades every day after six. You know what I mean? And we got some big boy packs here. 78 double. Got an England striker. No bet is Callum Wilson. Oh, it's Ollie Watkins this time. 
Yeah, we scrap her. We didn't have enough to do her. But 83 double, 84 four, and an 85 double. What are we going to get? Spanish, CDM, and it's Koke. Of course. Pack him every single day, I swear. But 85 three, 84 times four left. 84 times four. Spanish center mid and 84. Brilliant. And of course, like I said, I get Koke yet again. I was fuming. I've never quick sold someone faster in my life than him. Just get that horror out of there. He needs to go. But literally, we get a Raulho in this one. And that's it for today. Please like and subscribe if you have enjoyed. And that's Mudrich Magic done for today. And I'll see you boys tomorrow.